Each week, Harry is paid X dollars for the first 30 hours and 1.5 X dollars for everything after that. Each week, James earns X dollars for the first 40 hours and 2X for everything after that. So James works for 41 hours and James and Harry make the same amount. And we want to know how long did Harry have to work that week. So first of all, we'll start with James. He worked 41 hours. That's 40 regular hours plus one hour of overtime. The 40 regular hours, he earns 40x during that time. The one hour of overtime, he earns 2x during that time for a total of 42x. So now we go to Harry. And we don't know how many hours he's worked. Well, let's start him with the 30 hour work week that he has. Then he would get 30x hours. To get up to 42, he would have to earn another 12x in overtime. And we know that in overtime, let's say that he works H hours in overtime. If he works H hours in overtime, he's going to earn 1.5x times H in this overtime, and that's going to have to equal 12x. So, first thing I'm going to do is divide both sides by x. The x doesn't matter. I have 1.5h equals 12. Then I'm going to divide h, I'm going to divide both sides by 1.5. So h equals 12 over 1.5. And this is 8. So he works 8 additional hours of overtime which means that the total amount of hours he works in a week is 38. And this is answer choice D.